Welcome back. It's race weekend. The Firestone Grand Prix of St. Petersburg kicks off the 2022 IndyCar season Sunday afternoon. Our Kevin Lewis has the story of one rookie driver who's trying to make history and one racing legend who's just trying to fit in. Colombian born rookie Tatiana Calderon is set to be IndyCar's first full time female driver since 2013. She wants to be the fourth woman ever to finish in the top three of a race in this series. I truly believe it's one of the only sports where we can compete in equal terms and it's a sport that has given me so much that I want to share it with other people. So I hope that through my story more girls can can join the grid in the near future. Calderon fell in love with racing when she was nine. Now she's competing against some of the drivers she grew up watching on TV. It's surreal and I think it shows, you know, that with passion, with determination, um, you can achieve anything. So uh, should not be afraid to dream big. One of the drivers she watched was seven time NASCAR champion Jimmy Johnson, who, despite being in his second season in IndyCar, still feels like a rookie. Sure, I've raced, you know, my entire life, but this world of sing single seater driving, open wheel driving, um, it's just a different animal. Coming here for the second time, I, I have much less to worry about. You know, I knew where to park, for example, which last year I had no idea where I even parked or even had to get here. So uh, there's a lot of small victories already. Johnson finished 22nd at St. Pete last year. He hopes that number shrinks on Sunday. I already um, have seen improvements as I was preparing for this weekend's race. My time in the simulator on Wednesday, uh, a marked improvement in performance. Uh, so I'm hopeful that all transfers to the track and have a much better finish. The green flag waves just after noon on Sunday. In St. Pete, I'm Kevin Lewis, ABC Action News.